Hey everybody, it's Brody from Mountain Archery here, excited to announce the brand new 2023 line of Hoyt bow hunting bows. Um, so a few changes to the line this year. Uh, they are actually keeping around the RX-7. So RX-7, uh, the regular shorter 30 inch axle axle and the RX-7 Ultra. Um, to no surprise, that was a really big hit with us. Um, a lot of Gus guys here in the shop had a lot of success with that bow. So exact same coming back for this year, no changes made. Um, new to their aluminum bows, they're coming out with the brand new VTM. So they have the VTM uh, aluminum bow. They're coming out with the VTM 31. This is their shorter aluminum. So this bow is coming in at 30 and 5 8 inch axle to axle. Its ATA speed rating is 342 feet per second. It's got a six inch brace height. Uh, it's coming in at 4.6 pounds. Uh, the draw length range um, still has the HBX Pro Cam is 25 inches up to 30 inches. And then the peak draw weights are 30 and all the way up to 80 pounds in 10 inch in or 10 pound increments. Um, along with the VTM 31, they have the VTM 34. So this is a 33 and three quarter inch axle to axle bow. It's coming in at 334 feet per second. It's got a six and a quarter inch brace height. It's coming in at 4.8 pounds and it's got a draw length range of 26 inches up to 31 inches. And you can also get it in 30 pound up to 80 pound uh, limbs on that. So uh, one of the biggest things that they did this year is there's not a ton of changes from the Ventum Pro to this one, but what they did do uh, made this bow 31% quieter than the previous model year. Um, and with inline accessories, it's 11% quieter than that. So a uh, few things they did to accomplish that one of the biggest things is the whole shot V2 string silencers, uh, completely new string silencer, uh, very effective. Um, another thing they did is they widened the riser in a few different spots. So this is a very quiet, very dead in the hand bow. Um, if you were a 29 inch draw, we are getting some insane speeds out of this. 29 inch draw, 70 pounds. You need to check this bow out if you're a 29 inch draw. Another cool thing they did is called the drop slot. So if you have the integrate rest, there's a little slot in the riser cut out for your cord to go through. So that just keeps things more in line with your inline accessories. Um, like I said, the HBX Pro Cam staying around, uh, I'm happy about that. This is one of my most favorite cams ever. Uh, being able to adjust from 85 to 80% let off I personally love the 80% let off, but just having that personal preference, being able to adjust that for you. Another big thing I'm glad they brought back is the vital point grip. This rubber grip is in my opinion, the best in the industry. It is very comfortable, very repeatable, and it just feels awesome in your hand. Um, along with these bows, there's a bow that I do not have here today, and it's actually their aluminum speed bow. It's called the Z1S. So just a few specs on this bow. It's gonna be a 350 feet per second ATA speed rating. It looks to me like it has the exact same cams as the HBX Twin Turbo, if you're familiar with that from this last year. So that'll be exciting to look for. Um, it will be on a similar riser to the VTM. It has the vital point grip and everything. That should be a very fast bow. It's going to have a 33 inch axle to axle. It's going to have a 5 and 7 8 inch brace height. It's going to come in at 4.7 pounds and the draw length range is going to be from 25 up to 30 inch uh, draw length. So um, you can get that bow in peak draw weight of 30 all the way up to 70 pounds. It doesn't go any higher than 70. Um, Another cool thing for this year is their all new color. So they have a new solid color. It's called bourbon shown here on this RX-7. 
So it's kind of like a, a caramel brown, really good looking, pretty sexy color on this. Definitely need to check it out in person. Uh, they also have a new camo color I don't have here. It's called the Origin Raptor Highland Camo. So you'll definitely have to check that out. Um, and then they're also coming back with buckskin tan. Got that here, wilderness green, blackout, real tree edge, QU Verde 2.0 and then Sitka Optifade Subalpine and Elevated 2, along with the Bone Collector Edition and the Keep Hammering Edition. So guys, you really need to come and check out this bow. Uh, we've got the demos here in the shop, more on the way. Um, I think you're really gonna be impressed with this. This is an awesome new bow for this year. Come check it out, and uh, if you got any questions, give us a call. Thanks guys.